Hello everyone. Today I would like to share uh, how to benefit from the Web of Science database. So the first step is just Google Web of Science and go to this link, right? And then the first page appears will look like this. So in the search box, you type in any topic that you are doing. So let's say I'm doing a research on country governance and FTI. So I type in country governance and FTI. So by default, you choose topic and then hit the search button. So it gives you the list of articles related to the topic, right? Okay. So here it shows you there are 276 papers related to the topic. Now from this, from here you can further refine uh, your search. Let's say you want to limit the categories to economics, business and uh, business finance. And you want to limit the document type to only journal articles and review papers and then you hit refine so on the first page so there are four pages all together now on the first page you see uh, uh, about 50 50 leads uh, 50 papers on the list so by default it'll show you 10 per page but what i'm normally do if I choose 50 per page, it will make it easier for me to search the article. All right, now you can search for the article. Look for uh, topics with more highlights. Okay, okay, this one seems related for under investment, co movement, and home country institutions. Yeah, scroll down, scroll down. This one also is related. Okay, this one too. Maybe you want to have a look at this too. Okay, institutional factors also related to governance, right? So this one too. Okay, then you uh, go to this uh, printer icon and then click so it shows you five records have been selected so by default choose author title source and abstract yeah you want to get the abstract so, and then click print now you get a summary of the the abstracts now okay so I think this summary is already useful for you to do um, to write a literature review because you normally cite papers, the main findings of the previous studies in your introduction as well as in your results discussion. So this list is useful already. Yeah, before you go and get the full text. Yeah, the full text. You want to read the abstract first, see whether uh, the paper is really uh, really related to your um, res your research right and then finally you click print button here and then you can save as PDF or you can print out straight away from here I normally save as PDF first because I want to have uh, the copy the copy of the summary okay so you save save in your computer if you want to search for more articles you can go to the next page and repeat the same step right and then go to the print I uh, printer icon and save the summary of the abstracts i hope this um tip is useful for you yeah i think web of science i think we all know that web of science yeah was is a reliable source for uh, published papers so until next time next video thank you